good morning children today i am going to explain you your unit 3 unit 3 robinson crusoe before i start uh, the lesson let me give you a short a uh, brief on robinson crusoe robinson crusoe was a young wanderer one day he set out on a journey on his ship on the way he was hit by a storm and his ship was destroyed and he somehow managed to swim to a shore and started living in, in an island. He had been alone for many years and longed for company. One day he discovers a footprint on the sand. Let's find out what he did then. Okay, children, in this lesson, we shall study uh, what Robinson did when he found a footprint on the sand. One day, when I was going towards my boat, I was surprised to see the footprint. Footprint means, children, you know footprint? Footprint means the impression left by a foot on the ground of a man on the sand i stood amazed amazed means great surprise i listened i looked around me i could neither hear nor see anything i went up higher to look down i went up the shore shore means the land near the sea and down the shore but it was no good. I could find no other footprint but that one. I went to it again to see if there were any more footprints and to tell if it had been my imaginations. Imaginations means to form new ideas in his mind. But I was not mistaken for there was exactly the footprint the print of a foot toes heel every part of a foot i could not imagine how it came there i stayed a long time thinking but became more and more confused so one day when uh, robinson crusoe went towards his boat in that island he saw a footprint of a man which looked exactly like a human's footprint which had uh, toes heel and foot and after seeing that he was very confused and very frightened also at last i returned home very frightened frightened means to be scared or afraid looking behind me after every two or more or three steps mistaking every bush bush means a thick clump of grass or shrubs and trees to be a man when i came to my cave cave means a natural underground chamber in a hill side which i called my castle castle means a palace where king lives i ran inside it as if i was being chased i do not remember whether i used the ladder or went in by the hole in the rock which i called the door i ran for cover faster than any animal could run now when he saw the footprint he was very much frightened and he returned for he, to his home while he was returning he looked uh, uh, behind him for many times after two or three steps because he thought somebody must be there in the bush so when he reached his uh, cave cave uh, where he lived he ran inside because he thought that somebody was chasing and 
he closed the door and ran very fast inside his cave i did not sleep that night the more i thought about what i had seen the more afraid i became i thought it could be one of the savages savages means forest people who are brutal brutal means very dangerous of the mainland who had wandered out to the sea in a small boat and that night he could not sleep because he imagined he thought about uh, what he had seen he thought that footprint must be of the savages means forest people who came to the mainland from the uh, sea luckily i was not on shore at that time but what if he had seen my boat if he had seen the boat he would have realized that someone lived on the island and would soon return with other to kill and eat me and he thought himself that he was very lucky that nobody was uh, there in the uh, shore that time if they had seen his boat so robinson crusoe crusoe had a small boat also in his island if uh, someone had seen his uh, boat they would have easily realized that uh, someone is uh, already there in the island and they would have return with more people and kill him and eat him and so i lay fearful for many days and prayed for protection in doing so i was much comforted and began going out to investigate but even now as i went forward i looked behind me frequently because i was still very frightened and he did not come out of his cave for many days because he was very scared and he prayed for his protection so one day he thought to come out and investigate but when he moved forward he still looked behind frequently because he was very very frightened however as i went about for two or three days and saw nothing i became a little bolder bolder means stronger i decided to go down to the shore again and examine the footprint once more i decided to measure it with my own foot mark so he went uh, uh, to the shore near the footprint for many days but he could not find anybody so what happened he become more stronger more bolder so he went near the footprint and he decided to measure it with his own footprint he thought that footprint uh, uh, might be his own footprint so he decided to uh, check it as i come came closer to the footprint i realized realized means understand very clearly that it could not be my footprint because i had not come to this part of the beach since a long time secondly as i placed my foot along side that footprint it seemed larger than my own when now he came near the footprint and he placed his foot along side the footprint to compare what he saw what he find out that the footprint on the ground was much larger than his own feet my fear returned i went home again believing that there was someone there the land, the island was inhabited when he found out that the footprint was larger than his footprint his fear returned he realized that somebody is there in the island inhabitant means the island was occupied by other person or animals 
so children how do you like the story this part of the story was adapted from the writer daniel defoe's novel robinson crusoe okay children this must for today have a good day bye bye